What's going on YouTube? Jeans here. Hope you guys are having an amazing day today. We are back bringing you guys part two for my playthrough on Pokemon Legends Arceus for the Nintendo Switch. So guys, in the last episode, we got started with this game, basically finished up all the tutorials and grabbed ourselves our starter, which was Cyndaquil. And in today's video, we're going to be moving along with the main story, completing some research tasks and upgrading our star level. You guys already know the deal. If you do enjoy the content at any time, make sure you support me as a content creator by leaving a like on today's video. And if you're not subscribed to the channel, Come on, yo, get on top of that, subscribe to the channel, and join the community. It really does go a long way. But we're at the crafting table. I want to craft more Pokeballs right now because we're going to need a couple more. I have a few materials. I actually crafted 14. I need more Tumblestone. Definitely need more Tumblestones. But like I said, we have to actually uh, go do our main mission, which is uh, do some research progress and get our level up. So in order to get some research progress done, we have to go into the, uh, the Obsidian Fieldlands and catch some Pokemon and do some other research tasks. So we have that to do, and we also have this Wurmple task to do, which we already have a Wurmple, so we're kind of done that. We just have to take it back to the uh, the Jubilife City. But if I go into my Pokedex, this is how we know what research tasks to do. We have to go to our Pokemon. As you can see, our boy Cynical has a little capture around him, which means we kind of completed a lot of different research tasks for him. But we still have Bidoof to do, which I have to catch a couple more of them, maybe defeat uh, a couple more of them and catch heavy ones, all that good stuff. Same thing with Starly. Just go out there, defeat a couple, catch a few more. Same thing with Shinx, Wurmple, and Buizel. So that's what we're going to go do. We're going to go grind it up for a couple minutes and then head back to Jubilife City, cash in our task, all that good stuff, and roll out from there. But we are, well, we should be able to get our first... Uh, Star rank in today's video because we are super super close to getting there and then once we get there we can actually see how that actually plays out and what that will do so i'm gonna throw a pokeball there and i'm gonna wait to see if that actually catches them first no it doesn't you son of a biscuit why can't i catch none of these uh none of these uh badoof soon because i want to battle one and i want to catch one well can i catch you come on man get inside there yes sir okay so there we go caught one let's throw out our cynical and battle this one you toss it over there is that a battle no we didn't throw it close enough let's get ripping on him run it so this will actually help us on a research task defeat a few of these guys alongside with uh catching a few more oh he ran away yo what you mean my dude ran away super quickly let's catch another starly though come here starly we crouch in this grass right here is there starly like right there there is hello starly how you doing what's up pretty girl come here all right call that catch you and i'll defeat the other starly if this one catches if not we'll catch this starly right here awesome dope that one catches let's start the cynical let's have a nice little battle come here starly what's goody baby Hopefully it will let me battle it. Hopefully this one won't run. It has its guard up. Okay, it doesn't run away. Awesome. So let's just Ember. Do some big damage on it and roll out from there. Yo, dude, this game, phenomenal. Hopefully you guys are enjoying the play. I'm having a blast so far. Even though it's only part two, this game is amazing. If you guys want to catch more content from me, make sure you guys head over to my Twitch page. Name is at the bottom of the layout and link is down in the description below. Jeans25 on Twitch. We try and stream five plus days every single week, crushing this game, doing some content over there. So definitely come hang out, say what's up, all that good stuff. But there's a Shinx here. I kind of want to catch it. Oh, no, he sees me. Looks like we're going to have to battle this thing. And I'm actually going to KO this thing. Do I KO it or do I catch it? I might catch this one. Actually, yo, it's only level two? Let me whoop up on it. Let me hit it with an Ember. Should be able to one-tap it, right? Actually, the stats are kind of different in this game, so things are a few, uh, little bit different. So we're going to be able to double up on it. We're just going to kill it, say, get out of my face, take him out, drop him like that, and just keep continuing on doing these research tests. So what I want to do right now, uh, can I go across this bridge? I don't think I'm allowed to cross this bridge yet. Let me actually see. Oh, actually, yeah, let's do this. Uh, get, get that material. Get, the, get those uh, get those abricorns and see what this guy's gonna say. Can I just walk past him? I cannot. It's like an invisible wall. So I guess you, oh, you have to have your first star in order to go into that area. Okay, so that's pretty cool. So that actually, the stars allow you to go to different areas in the game. I do dig that. I do dig that. We're gonna catch another Bidoof here. Actually, do I kill this Bidoof? I'm gonna kill this Bidoof. What's goody, Bidoof? What's goody, Bidoof? Because I feel like I need to battle a few more. Catch a few Starlies, go find some more Buizels and a few, few Wurmples, and then head back to the city. Which is lovely. This thing has rollout, dude. This thing might kill me. This thing gonna kill me? Can I switch, like, agile? I wish I could. Action order. That's the action order. Uh, I'm gonna hope we can actually kill it here. Ember poking out here. Or are we dead? High roll me. We're dead. Badoof is looking around. Oh, and he doesn't go. That's awesome. That is awesome. So, Ember's gonna poke out here. Badoof, get out my face. So, we take out another one of them for a research task. And I'm gonna see how this is going. Number to feed it went up. That's awesome. And I want to head to my uh, my bag real quick and just give my Cyndaquil potion because he's our only Pokemon that we're using right now. He's the only Pokemon on our team until I find the other ones that I want. And I think we're not gonna find them until later in this game, but we'll see. My team's looking good. My team is looking good. Let's head to our Pokedex. See what we got cooking here. So Puzzle, we need to uh, catch another one of them, and we need to defeat one of them. That'll be good. Wurmple, we need to catch another one of them and defeat another one of them. That's fine. You uh, number defeat it. I was just say two with like a shining thing and it's not checked. I'm a little confused. I don't think the first one counted. 
Test with unreported data. So, okay. I gotta defeat another Starly. So I guess I gotta do this stuff. We do if I gotta catch another one. But it says we have three. So we gotta catch another one. Here's Badoof. Come here, Badoof. Oh no, we gotta report it to our guy. We have to report it to the guy in order to uh to cash in. Okay, that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Another Buizel's right here, and I don't know if I should defeat it or catch it. I'm actually gonna defeat this thing. Shit's gonna be a little tough. Let's start out the Starly up against it. Because you know my boy Cyndaquil is not doing much against it. And I don't care if Starly goes down here. We're just kind of using this thing to kind of whip up on him. But it's level three. We're gonna fight him here and drop a little gust. But yo, I love how you can run around here. And like look at the battle from a whole different perspective. Like, look at this, yo. We're watching it from the weasel side. That is amazing. That is amazing. We do some big damage on it, and Starly's doing some work. I love me some Starly, yo. Starly's ripping. Starly's gonna be able to take him out here. Awesome. I'll definitely catch the next weasel and roll out from there. Awesome, cool. Dope, dope, dope. Dope, dope, dope. Let's switch back to our Cyndaquil here. All right, I gotta go this way. And I saw some Tumblestone. Yeah, there's some Tumblestone. Need that Tumblestone because we just use a ton of it on, uh, on what's it called? Can I actually throw this all the way over there? I don't know if I hit it good. No, I did not. There's another Buizel here. I'll actually catch this one. Oh, he wants to fight. I don't think that Pokeball will do anything. He wants to fight. So, you know what? Let me switch out to my Starly. Come here. Yo, he's coming after me. Yo, chill on me. Chill on me. I had to throw out a Pokemon to actually battle this thing. I'm going to catch this one. I am definitely going to catch this one. We're going to fight him. We're going to gust him up. We're going to catch him in the battle stance. So, by doing damage to him a little bit and then switching to our item and rocking out from there. So, Starly's good up against these Buizels because, you know... Cyndaquil wouldn't really do too well if he's using a water move. He would definitely get rolled. Because those Bidoofs did some mean damage. The Bidoofs were just rolling out, using rollout, and just dominating me. Doing half my damage. Rip it up into me. Rip it up into me. But we get a Medicinal Leak. We also get uh, some levels, all that good stuff. And we get some more stuff for our research levels. That's pretty cool. I definitely gotta go up here because I know more Wurmples spawn up here. There is another Bidoof there, but I want to actually throw this here. And I think I want to fight a Starly, right? I want Cyndaquil to do that, and then I want him to come back, and we'll fight this Starly, because I know we need another Starly to battle. Come here, Starly. What's goody, dog? What's goody? I think I have to catch one more as well. I think I have to catch one more. Oh, Starly ran away. You son of a biscuit. Medicinal leak right here. Uh, should I catch this thing? Might as well. Get my research level up. Might as well huck a Pokeball at it. If it doesn't catch it, it doesn't catch it. It's all good. Of course, it hops out. Get out of my face. Get out of my face. But, yo, it's nighttime. It is nighttime, and there's some Wurmples over here. I do have to defeat some Wurmples, so I'll, I'll catch this first Wurmple. By smoking it with a Pokeball, and then this next one, I'll swap over to Cyndaquil, and we'll battle. I'll wait for that to actually finish up, see if we catch it. Awesome. So we catch a nice lovely Wurmple. Let's defeat one now. My Cyndaquil should have no problem just running Ember and just ripping through these things. Let's get it. I should actually defeat two, because I don't think I defeated one yet. One shot. Yeah, get out of my face. Yes, sir, Cyndaquil. Run it. But it's so quick. That's what I love about this game. This game is just so fluent. You can legit be running around, like, before the battle even ends. It's amazing. It's amazing, but let's take out this Wurmple here. I actually have to go find a couple more Shinx here. And I think we should be good. I think we can actually go uh, hand in our levels now. So we're exploring this wild area. I do want to get some more, like, materials and stuff. Oh, yo, Drift Limbs! Yo, come here! Do I have to sneak up on these things? I feel like I have to sneak up on these things. They're flying. Yo, Drift Limbs! Cool, yo, new Pokemon. I think it had, like, gas around it. Let's see if I can smoke this thing with a Pokeball. Yo, catch it, yo. I would love to catch it, too. Look at that! Catch it! Let's go, Drifflim! I would love to catch another one. Come here. Oy. Right in the tall grass. So sneaking up on Pokemon, I think give you a higher chance to actually catch it. Which is really, really cool. So there we go. Yo, two caught. Awesome, yo. Awesome. I'm loving it. I'm loving it so much. I'm going to switch to my Cyndaquil, and I'm going to get some uh, more materials as I'm heading back here. So I'll throw that here, and I'll get rolling out. And I really want this Tumblestone. So we get three Orange Berries. Oh, dude, this game. This game. It's amazing me. It really is. It's so, so good. I'll toss this over here. Drift Bloom spawns, which is awesome. We got a new Pokemon. You'll get that. And I'll just keep looking around here for a little bit. Because there might be another new Pokemon. I don't know how many new Pokemon there are. Voodoo's hanging out here. Pretty cool. And I heard the Shinies are overworld in this game. So, like, you don't have to go into battle to actually see if they're shiny. If they're shiny, you'll just see them in the overworld. But, yo, this is really good. We got some Shinx over here. I'm going to throw my Pokeball right here to actually... Did I miss it? No, we got it. Throw my Pokeball over there to get that. And do I catch a Shinx here? That's exactly what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna switch the Shinx. I had to dip down here. See if I can catch two. I'll catch two and battle another one. So there's this. Catch that one. I wanna catch the second one too. Awesome. So Shinx gets caught. And can I snipe this other one? Sneak up on it. Little back throw here. Come here, dog. Hey. Toss that. And what does that mean when it hits like that? Is that a critical catch? I don't know. Oh, Shinx leaving. Come here, come here. 
Let me give you another try here. Come on, catch it. Catch him. Catch him. Awesome. So we catch him there. Let's bring out our Cyndaquil. And I, dude, I just love how much we can do in so little time. Like, we're just running around, picking up stuff, battling Pokemon, catching Pokemon at the same time. It's amazing. It really is. Let's start the Cyndaquil. And let's take out this, uh, let's take out this Shinx right here. I'll defeat it because we just caught two. Our levels are definitely getting a lot higher, which is awesome. So I feel like once we go back to our boy, we can have another star level on our agenda, which is great. I'm just going to use Quick Attack. We'll soak that up all day. And we'll rock out from there. But I do want to go back and actually upgrade. Oh, yo, he double hit at me. Hey! I guess Quick Attack uh, makes him go twice. But yo, that thing went twice and ripped up. He definitely ripped up. Leave me alone. Leave me alone! All right, so we go over here. There's a Drift Plum. I could actually defeat a Drift Plum, which I want to do. I want to do. So let's go in here. And heal up my Cyndaquil because, you know, Cyndaquil's my boy. We haven't defeated a Drift Plume yet. Oh, why am I giving him that? No, I don't want to give him Orange Berries. I'd rather give him Potions. So what are Potions used for? All right. Let's, uh, oh, no. Did he disappear? Son of a biscuit. My boy disappeared. My boy Drift Plume disappeared. Okay. Let's head back here, I guess, over to Sil. We already caught a few Drift Plumes. Can I run up these rocks? Wait, why do I hear weird noise? I just heard a weird noise, and I'm being spied. I guess that's by the Shinx. I hear another drift blim. I did hear another drift blim just spawn. Where the heck you spawn at, drift blim? Yo, why? Oh, wait, is it down here? I saw something I can hit. Yeah, there you are. Hey, drift blim. Cynical, get it. The thing's gone. All right, I want to fight the drift blim. Come here, drift blim. Drift blim, I want to fight you. Yes, okay, cool. We finally get our fight with the Drift Blim. After this, we're going to head back to our place. And uh, we're going to hand in our side quest. And we're going to finish up on the main mission to get our star level up. Which is awesome. Give me a burn. Confusion. Hey, yo, chill on me. How much damage is that going to do? Did a lot of damage. Low key, level 4 doing a lot of damage. We chip it up. We got a burn, which is awesome. Love your little burn. He's looking around. We should be able to finish him off with one more. And I don't know what burn does. It didn't take away damage at the end of his turn. But there it is. Drift Blim drops down here. We defeat one. And we get a, a VB choke. What is that? You get some items for defeating Pokemon too, which I think is really, really cool. I think it's really, really cool. Pick up this medicinal leak and let's get rolling out here. Any more trees I can hit up? No, we chillin'. We'll head back to the base. And what I want to do before we actually do anything is go here and rest up my Pokemon. So if you come into this little rest joint, you can rest up and your Pokemon will heal back to full, which is awesome. And the time of day will change. You can actually change the time of day. From here. But I can talk to my boy right here. You call it nine Pokemon carry report? Of course, man. Look at that. Two Drift Blims, some Shinx. We defeated a few Pokemon as well. So we get 930 Poke Dollars, and our level should go up, right? Give me my star rank. Give me my star rank. Oh, it seems like you made some new observations. Let's look at them. Weasel right here. Okay. Oh, it gives you preferred food. It's really cool. And we finish up with Shrinks here. So he's in our Pokedex on uh, research level 10. So if you get him to 10, that's when you get him, which is pretty cool. So there goes our, our rank should go up here, right? Yes, sir. So next rank. Did we rank up? I think we did. Make good progress on these tasks, Jeans. I do believe you're ready to move up on the ranks. Awesome. Let's head back to the village and report the good news to Captain Klein. You earned yourself a star. Let's go. So we're heading back to Jubilee City. And like I said, we're getting our first star in today's video. So our little section below our face cam is going to work wonders. It's going to work wonders. But from here, before we even head to uh, Captain Psy, we had a little side mission to catch Wurmple. We actually grabbed it in the last episode. So I want to head over here and give it to this guy. I believe it's this dude right here. Is it you? I think it's you. Let me take a sip of water. Have you got my Wurmple? Oh, yes, sir. I got your Wurmple. Which one do you want, dude? I'll give you my worst Wurmple. I'll give you this one right here. There you go, buddy. There's your Wurmple. Yeah, look at it. I love how you just drop in the overworld. Wurmple's actually rather big. I'll give him props. Yo, Wurmple's a giant caterpillar. It would definitely scare the heck out of me if I seen one of those in the, in, my, in real life. Because in Pokemon, you're just like, yo, these things are these things stink. They're annoying. But, yo, he's pretty big. I'm not going to lie, yo. Wurmple can evolve. We complete a request. And we get Dazzling Honey, which is awesome. Which is awesome. Can I grab this stuff right here? These flowers look like I can pick up. I guess I cannot. But let's head inside here. Let's continue on with our main mission and see what our next main mission is. I think we're going to explore a new area, which is absolutely amazing. Which is absolutely amazing. But can I talk to you? Can I get a bag upgrade yet? Never mind. I cannot get a bag upgrade yet. I know that dude, you're able to talk to him and get bag upgrades. But we're going to go over here. He's going to judge our research and what we did. And let's see what he says. Hmm, you made progress. It seems you have earned yourself a star. Let's go! Add it to the stars, baby. Level one on the stars. There's ten total stars. And I believe they get harder and harder to get every time you actually uh, level up or get a star. So, it's pretty cool. So, there we go. Lovely little star rank. Doop, doop, doop. And I believe, like, as you... Oh, we got heavy balls. We Pokemon up to level 20 will obey you. So, we got heavy balls, which is cool. Crafting recipe for heavy balls. There's recipe... Okay. Black tumblestone, which we do not have in Abricom. 
I guess we get black tumble stones and different things. And we get a recipe for revives. That is awesome. So we craft up some different material. I'm going to head out, head back to the land. I believe we can actually head to a different area now, which I want to do. And I want to grab another side quest, which could be dope. And we can talk to the people in town and see what's going on. For a day, at least, you earn yourself a meal at the Wallflower and a good night rest. Okay, awesome. So we'll go eat our meal. We'll go do all of our other stuff before we get our next main mission. Because it kind of works like Breath of the Wild. You have your main mission, you can go do that. Or you can branch off, do side missions. Or you can do them both at the same time. So we're down here munching again with Akari and uh, Professor Leviton? I think that's his name? Yeah, Leviton. Okay. Is, this a is Leviton like a tree? Because the reason I say that is because every single professor's name is based on a tree. Yeah, Professor Oak, Professor Birch, Professor Sycamore, you name it. They're all trees, which is absolutely hilarious. I love how they kept it going, but I'm not sure if Leviton is a tree. Someone let me know in the comment section down below. I would absolutely love it. I would absolutely love it, but... It's the next day. And we're going to get rolling out here. We are going to get rolling out here. Listen, do you have a time a, a bit? Yeah, we, we, we have a little bit of time. What you want, lady? What you want? Thank you. I've been waiting for you at the training grounds then. If you caught a lot of Pokemon, you may want to visit uh, the pasture to change up your team. Okay, so yeah, you can change up your team by going to the training grounds or at the rest camps we were just at. Which is pretty cool, but I do not want to change my team. I have no other Pokemon I want on my team. But I have to meet her at the training ground. I could actually talk to you. Do you have anything to say? Oh, young man, what can I help you with today? I can get hairstyling. Okay, so. Do hairstyling there. What else can I do? I actually want to pick up a side quest, which could be pretty cool. I'll pick up a side quest on my way back. Can I buy stuff here? What's this thing? What's this place? See something uh, you want? Okay, so you can buy stuff. What is this? Cake Lord Basic. Type of field provision that enhances the flavor of other food mixed with it. Okay, so I can. This is like a little shopping center, which is pretty cool. And over here is this clothing. I know this is somewhere to eat. And this is a little craft table. I could craft Pokeballs. I could do other things. Can I buy recipes from you? That's a good question. Let's talk to them. Here are the craft folks. We sell material and recipes. Yeah, yo, let me see your uh, recipes. What you got? Remedy. A remedy. What does that do? Honey cake, aux powder, a recipe. What does that do? Can I click on it? it? Doesn't even tell me what it does. I'll buy them later. I really don't want to spend up all my money just yet. I only have 5,000. I really do not have that much. So we're going to go to the battlegrounds, training grounds here. Finish up with this and then roll out back to the area. <coughs> all right, Akari. What do you got for me? Listen, I had an epiphany. And that is... Yo, this is just a Starly right behind me. You want to... Oh, you want to be my partner? Okay. Heck yeah, I want you to be my partner. And you got a Pikachu. Can I catch that? I would love to have a Pikachu just chilling in my Pokedex ripping up with it but the main thing i really want to do right now is finish this and head right back to that wild area hopefully we can head to a new area and just keep catching pokemon and rolling out from there the server course card challenges you to a battle got it she sent out pikachu i got my cynical ready to rip up but it's weird my cynical is level 11. he's shown here level 11 but like versing like younger pokemon he doesn't do that much damage but nine's a good level he goes first yo he paralyzes me how dare you man how dare you uh i could roll out when I learned rollout, I didn't even know I learned rollout, but I am going to use rollout. Yo, just because the next one's going to be stronger, we're fixated on using rollout, which is awesome. He's going to use his Thunder Shock, which will be able to soak up, and he might go two times in a row. Is he going two times in a row? No. We go next. We'll watch pop out here. Pikachu, get on out my face. Get on out my face. But yeah, I can definitely say this Pokemon game is definitely different from a lot. Definitely different from a lot in a good way. It's definitely taking a good turn in the Pokemon franchise. So I feel like Gen 9 is going to be phenomenal. I think Gen 9 is going to maybe top this game. We'll see. But right now, like, out of all the beginnings of Pokemon games, this has definitely been the best one. This has definitely been the best one, in my opinion. We take out Pikachu. We get a level. Hopefully, she heals up my Pokemon, because that Pikachu hit me hard. He hit me real hard. But let's see what he says. Let's see what we have to do. I just want my mission. Oh, we get a typing matchup little thing, which is awesome. It shows us what's super effective, what's not very effective, what's neutral. That is awesome. In all the other games, we never got that, which is really, really cool. And we get to meet a new character, Zisu. The name is Zisu, captain of the security corps. Awesome. What's up? I see you got some fighting. You figured I stopped by and give, give you some advice. Bibbidi bobbidi boobidi bobbidi. Let's move on. Let's see what she has to say. I think she might teach us uh, styles. Right? Yeah, agile and strong style. Okay. We're going to be able to use it? I think this is where we unlock it, which is awesome. I've, I've been waiting for it. Once you, uh, your Pokemon has mastered a move, you can... Okay, so you have to master a move. Okay. So I guess there's ways to master moves. 
like level it up or maybe go into like a training grounds like here and doing it that way so i guess we'll see a request for me okay so we got a new main mission which is awesome and what do we got to do here go to the obsidian and meet my in a diamond of the diamond clan so i got to go to the uh the field my city quote is at full health and i want to grab a side quest in the meantime too so i can go here and check all my missions as well so i'm gonna go here i think all of our side quests are done right we have nothing rolling yeah we have nothing rolling we just have to go meet her in the obsidian fields so i'll pick up this side quest as we move along here as well let's see what she has to say i wonder what starley oh she i think she wants starley you're that newcomer who fell from the sky are you heading outside the village i am what do you want a starly i have a starly right now i have a starly right now do you want the starly you can have it let's see if i can just talk to her please let me see a starly in the entry of the pokedex wait wait entry in the pokedex at the moment you complete it oh i didn't i did not complete starly i did not complete Starly. i need like one more catch i need like one more level let's see what this guy has so we complete starly while we're out there and we'll grab this one i know shink's ears okay so shink's over here what does this guy want no use i can't remember this keep me up all night Hey, aren't you a server coach? If you can catch a shank, yeah, yo, I got one, I got one right now. Please don't make me go back into the wild and then come back. Let's see if I can talk to him. I want those shanks show me? Yeah, yo, take this one. Take this one right here. All yours. All yours, buddy. There you go. Finish up this quest and we'll get some rewards and stuff. But like I said, I'm really doing the side missions just to complete them because I want 100 percent this game. I'm a completionist when it comes to games. Like when I buy a game, I really want to get the whole value out of the all the $60 that I'm spending on the game. So I'd like to complete it to its fullest potential. But there we go. We take out that that mission. We have one side mission to go, which is just uh, complete Starly's uh, Pokedex entry. So I think we just need to catch a few, maybe battle a few more, and just go from there. And then we keep heading on with the main mission. I think we're going to explore a new main area, which is awesome. But yo, this scene doesn't get old. When you see that opening of the Obsidian uh, Fields, it's amazing. But here's Bolo. Boo. Yo, what's up, man? Did I surprise you? I bet I did. I was trying to anyway. There's a secret technique to catching Pokemon, you see. Ooh, you gonna teach me a new technique? The secret backstrike technique. Oh, is this when you uh throw it at the back? Hitting a wild Pokemon from behind uh, for a higher chance. Okay, so that is why it makes that uh big black and white kind of like catch kind of thing that I thought was a critical catch. It's called a backstrike. That's pretty cool to learn. So if I go there, and is this a side mission? I kind of want to pick it up. The Starly one isn't that, that big. Are you that boy from Syracuse? Blah, blah, blah. Listen here, I need to tell you about this great cake lore recipe I've been in. I call it the mushroom cake. I poured 20 years of mushroom forging now into it, blah, blah, blah. Uh, so I guess I have to make it. But you're the talk of the village. If people see you're making uh, my mushroom cakes famous as you, I'm sure they'll want to give it a go. I'll teach you the recipe. All you have to do is return, is spread a good word by using it. Okay. So go ahead. Just give me the mission. Mushroom cake marketing. So I guess I just need to give Morel item he's requesting. Requesting. So he needs a springy mushroom. So from here, I saw there was another side quest, but we'll just roll over here and go towards our main quest. But let me actually check the Starly real quick. I want to check the Starly because I have to finish that up in the in the Pokedex. I can actually click on this thing and go over. No, where's my Starly at? Where's Starly at? Is it over this way? How do I go over to Starly? So click on it. There we go. A. So I have to catch one more. One more will actually probably level it up or defeat two more. Or numbers catch without being spotted. Numbers I evolved. Uh, yeah, I think I'm just going to have to catch one more. Or defeat one more? No, catch one more. Let me look at it one more time. Without being spotted. I only caught four. Okay, so all of them I caught without being spotted. So if I see a Starly, I have to catch it without being spotted. Pretty simple enough. Simple enough. So let's move down here. I know Starlies are down towards the way we're going. So we're going to head here actually grab this. Come here. Give me this. And throw my Cynical over at this tree. Just to get this uh, Abricoms. I need as many as I can. Here are the Starlies, yo. Come here, Starlies. Hey, yo, chill on me, Starly. I know you don't see me. I know you don't see me. I think this one might see me. I don't know, but we're going to catch it. <laughs> and I'll catch this other Starly. Can I hit him from here? Oh, you dipped. You son of a biscuit. Hopefully this Starly doesn't see me. Chill on me, Starly. <laughs> we're in the grass now. Catch that one. I don't mind catching this one either. Come here, Starly. Oh, she's dipping. I'll catch you. That was an awful throw. That was an awful throw. Where's the Starly at? Can I hit him? Got him. Okay. So from here, we'll switch to our Cyndaquil. We'll throw this. I should have actually crafted more Pokeballs. I should have crafted more Pokeballs, but there we go. Catch ourselves a Starly. We should actually be finished up on our uh, missions for a Starly. 
I think we did. I can actually check in the Pokedex if I really want to. Which I am going to do. Starly. Oh, no. I have to report it. Yeah, if I report it, we'll definitely level up our Starly, which is awesome. But now that we have our first start, we can actually make our way towards this area, which is a brand new area in the game. I guess I have to talk to Galaxy member. Confirm I have one star. And I should have crafted more stuff. I should have crafted more Pokeballs. But, yo, what's goodie, man? And I thought I just saw a new Pokemon. There is a Munchlax chilling here. Lovely little Munchlax. What's up, Kari? And a new character that we get to meet. Dope, dope, dope. What's up? Oh, this is Mai. Okay, so this is a new character that we had to go see. And she has a Munchlax, yo. The Munchlax is looking tough. I'm one of uh, the Wardens of the Diamond Clan. You may call me Mai. Hi, Mai. I suppose you might not even know what a Warden is if you're new to Hisui. So what is it? Let me know what a Warden is. You feel confident that you can lead your Pokemon in battle? Yes, sir. I got a Cyndaquil. Have you seen my Cyndaquil? That thing rips. <laughs> That's good to hear. The Survey Corps uh, of yours certainly wasn't up to the task. This here is my partner, Munchlax. We are raised together like siblings. He battles side by side, blah, 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 blah. Dude, I'm like a Munchlax. I gotta catch one of them. I gotta catch a Munchie. And are we battling it? Oh, I think I get to use maybe my Agile or Strong Style now. Which is pretty cool. Or is this like a challenge in order to get to the next area? Level 10, we should be fine with it. Fight, let's go for an Ember here. I could go for Rollout. But Special Attacking Moves definitely better up against Munchlax. We get a crit. Give me a burn. And this thing so Hey! Hey! I'm dead. I'm dead. What the... What just happened? He's going to rip through my team. I guess we'll throw out Badoof. The Starly will just get dropped by it. Dude, this thing ripped. Ripped my Cyndaquil. No problem. But I guess we'll, we'll get fixated on rollout. See how much damage we can do. Touch just my attack. Get out of my face. This thing's going to go for rollout. That's going to take out my Badoof, isn't it? All right, Badoof, see, Badoof has 80 HP? God dang, Badoof. Run it. Get some damage off. This thing's going to go for a roll. Can we dodge one? Of course, we can't dodge one. Uh, do we have any revives? I'm kind of scared here. I am terrified here. I guess we'll throw out our Starlies. Starly, get on out there. Hopefully, Starly can outspeed and just get off some damage with its Gust or Aerial Ace. Use Aerial Ace. Hey, cool. It outspeeds. Not bad damage, Starly. I love it. I love it. Rollout's going to take us out. Bye, Starly. Jeez, yo. This Munchlax! This Munchlax is ripping, but we should be fine here unless he uses a potion, which I surely hope he doesn't. Let's bring out this level 9 Starly. And let me just run a run a little Gust on it. We're not Gust. Does this one have Aerial Ace? Because Aerial Ace did good damage. Let's do it. Aerial Ace coming to throw here. KO it. Let's go. We did it. Yo, dude, that Munchlax just slapped up on me. Battle decided. Awesome. Get out of my face. Give me my levels. I have to revive my Cyndaquil. Or will she at least heal my Pokemon? I feel like she would. Yo, look at this the Munchlax. He's like, dang it, dude. I let you down. <laughs> okay, cool. She heals up my Pokemon. We are thriving here. Give me my next main mission. Let's see what you got cooking. Five Viva Chokes. So that can actually uh, help me with uh, revives. And it's just a great little uh, little crafting material. We're getting a lovely little call on our Arc Phone. Your Arc Phone is beeping. <laughs> and I'm like, yo, check out this picture. Look what I did to my friend last night. <laughs> so I guess she's giving us a new mission. Actually, head to a new area. I'll leave this in your hands. You'll do great out there. I know it. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I might want to head back to town before I actually head out on this mission, but I feel like we're fully healed up. Maybe we need more Pokeballs. I would love to get like a crafting center. Would be really, really nice. But she's talking to me about the Diamond Clan. Blah, 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 blah. I'll figure this out myself. Pokemon like Graces, the Deer Track Heights is one of those honored a few. Texas Sinnoh region. Let's get moving. Okay. Make your way to uh, Deer Track Heights where an alpha, po oh, an alpha Pokemon is causing us trouble. Maybe we have to go do that. We have some Cricketots here. I actually want to catch you, Cricketot. We get a backstrike. That thing turns back on us. That should be a catch then. So this here. And we get a Cricketot. Brand new Pokemon for us. And we're getting a bunch of new material. Yo, dude, this game is lovely. I'm loving it. I'm loving it so much. So let's just keep heading this way. Looking for new materials. New Pokemon. There's extra Cricketots. I'll catch more Cricketots as well. I actually want to, uh, I actually want to defeat a cricket out here. Oh, yo, a burpee leaped out. I'm going to catch him. I'm going to catch him. He popped out of the tree. Uh, hopefully this doesn't kill it. I'm going to catch it. A burmy, dude. Don't kill it. Ah, oh, killed it. All right. That, that'll go towards a research anyway. I want to drop a cherry berry and a, and a viva choke. I'm going to actually KO you. Put you in my Pokedex. And these are great Pokemon for leveling up my Cyndaquil, yo. Great Pokemon for leveling up my Cyndaquil. Oh, cricket out ran away. Get out of my face. Freak it out right away. And what is that? That looks like a, a Viva choke. Let me actually pick this up. That. Awesome. And what do we got over here? More Starlies. Not too worried about Starlies. I want this. 
I just want to keep moving forward here. Just keep moving forward, grabbing materials, catching new Pokemon. There was a Burmy in the tree, which is hilarious. I want to fight you. I want to fight you, dude. And yo, we got a jam playing. We got a nice little Sinnoh jam playing. Rick Tide's keeping his guard up. I should just be able to fight it and drop a nice big Ember. So we are going to go up against our first noble Pokemon. Maybe we'll do that in today's video. I would love it. So this, we get XP. My boy levels up. And we'll get some more materials. But I really need more, uh... I really need more Pokeballs. And what is that? Is that a Geodude? And what's up, dude? Actually, I don't want to take his side quest just yet. Oh, he wants to fight me. Do we have to fight him? Let's see if I can hide here. Oh, he sees me. Oh, chill on me. Hey! Hey! Do I have to fight him or can I hide? Yo, chill on me. I want to catch you. And his, like, can that scene thing go away? All right, cool. It went away. Turn around. I don't want you to see me, Geo, dude. Hide him. Yeah, turn around. I'm coming for you. Yeah, I don't want to fight you, man. Come on, come on, come on, come on. And I think there's new material to it, right? Backstrike. Yes, sir. Big old backstrike. Come here, baby. Catch that thing. New Pokemon on the squad? Let's go. New Pokemon and a new... Peppa plant. Okay, that's pretty cool. I think we need more Pokeballs. I absolutely love some more Pokeballs. Got some trees over here. And we'll just keep moving along in this area. So I guess we just have to keep moving up towards this highlands, towards the area. Oh, give me the Peppa plant. I didn't mean to die. Any new Pokemon? I kind of want to save my Pokeballs. Oh, I can actually fight you, dude. But I'd rather catch it. Oh, looks like I need to fight it. Come on, you, dude. It's goody, man. Um, he might actually do some work on my Cyndaquil, which I'm kind of scared of. But I feel like we should be fine. Let's go for the Ember. Only downside right here. Okay, not bad damage. And we get a burn, which is lovely. Don't use roll out. Miss us. Oh, you're the best in the world. Can I switch to strong style? Burn is chipping some damage. How do I switch to strong style? I don't think I can yet. Oh, I can do it with quick attack. I can do it with quick attack right now, but quick attack will not do a lot of damage. Okay, so we can do that with quick attack. A burn should be able to take him out. Roll out. Can we eat up one? Love you. I love you. He's fixated on Roll. And look at the other Geodude just like standing here like, yo, get him, Geodude. <laughs> or is it a double battle? Yo, it's a double battle. Hey, yo, get out of my face. It's a double battle. I might just catch this one. He's using Mud Slap. That's going to be super effective. Oh, my God. We have to catch it here. He became obscured. Let's throw a Pokeball at him. He became obscured. We have to catch him here and then potion up. I should have made more recipes. Should have made more recipes. Hopefully, there's like a camp up as we get closer to this place but there we go we catch this pokemon and save our defeat lovely yo i didn't know the pokemon can line up the pokemon legit lined up and tried fighting me get out my face let's heal up our cynical here i think two potions are gonna oh that one's 60 points that's lovely that is lovely awesome 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 but yeah hopefully there's a camp up here i can craft more pokeballs and stuff and what is this oh it's a new stone that i need the black uh stone we get it we get it cynical so he's up here and what's this called again Black Tumblestone. That's what it is. Lovely. New material. Loving it so much. We got more Tumblestone. And what is this? More Starlies. I really don't want to battle you, Starly. I'm just kind of wandering around with you. More Geodudes. I could catch another Geodude, which I would like. But this thing's going to attack me here. If I can actually hit this thing with a Pokeball. Yo, all set. See if I can catch it. Keep moving forward. Come on. Catch him. Awesome. Dope. Can I move up here? I know we have to go this way. But I want to head over here. I let it head over here. Can I, I can do whatever I want, right? I can do whatever I want. When I want. <gasps> chill on me. 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 I want to catch the other one. Chill on me. Chill on me, dearling. This other one doesn't see us, yo. Don't you dare turn around. Come here. There we go. Close enough. Yeet. Yes, backstrike. Come on, yo, catch it. Need a new Pokemon. Then I'll fight the other one. Yes, sir. Yo, a Stantler. And I know there's a, a Hisuian evolution of him. Let's switch to my uh, Cynical here and I'll fight this one. This one's cooking. Oh, we sniped it. Yo, we sniped it for the battle. This one was cooking in circles. Level 11. God dang. God dang. This thing used Hypnosis. Okay, we dodged it. This thing's quick. This one's a strong style. Or, you know, we're just going to go here. Ember coming out here. Not bad damage. Give me a burn. Give me a burn. 
He's gonna use tackle. How much damage are you doing? I don't like that one bit. I just want to defeat it for my books. Do I have any revives? I might have to run. He ran! Get out of my face! Get out of my face, yo. That thing. No, I don't wanna. I don't wanna battle you. There you go. Get that. There you go. Cool. Alright, we out of here. Right, let's give another potion to my boy here while we can. And then let's go uh, continue on with that main mission. Because we've been recording for a good amount of time. And I would love to complete this main mission. And at least be able to head back to the uh, the Jubilee City. Let's go here. Oh, I got to pick up both these. Bang, bang. Let's get moving along here. Hello, my. I'm here. Do I get the face off of my first noble Pokemon? Let's do it. Let's do it. I would love to do it. Let's see. Oh, yo. This game's awesome. This game is great. Oh, so even your professor decided to join. Oh, my professor showed up? This guy's hauling. He came a mile away. In his work clothes, too. It's Pokemon researcher, I need to use pictures, she said. Okay. Show me my first nimble Pokemon. So I really want to catch a new Pokemon for my team. I know who I want, but I haven't got I haven't seen any of my dudes yet. Oh, it's Cricket Tie. I do not want him on my team. But he's sick. D Lulu Whoop. <laughs> I would love to fight it. Are you ready for your battle? Heck yeah! Run it! Oh, she healed on my Pokemon. I didn't even need to use a potion. But I have Cyndaquil. Cyndaquil will be super effective, but I know you gotta, like, dodge these Pokemon and kind of get running around with them. That's pretty tough. Let's roll out. Be careful, Gene Joe. I'm fine. I'm fine. Pokemon whose eyes go are called Alpha Pokemon? Yeah, yeah, we already know that. We already indeed know that. Yo, what's good, dog? This is my Cyndaquil. Let's go. Battle the Alpha Pokemon. My dude! Cricketot! <laughs> First alpha Pokemon. This thing's sick. So I get to throw out Cynical. I thought I had to like run around and dodge dodge this guy. Press the Y button during battle. Check your attack order. Okay. He's filled with wild might. He's level 12, which isn't too bad. Use the aerial ace. Aye! Let's wait to hit this thing. I'm going to hit this thing with Ember. It's going to be super effective. How much damage are we going to do? It's a big damage. Half damage. And we burned it, which is awesome. Aerial ace. My Cynical's dead. What's going on? My Cyndaquil's just been getting tear torn up today. He's hurt by burn. I feel like my Starly should just be able to come out here and rip it up. Yo, I want a new Pokemon on my squad. This isn't like any other Pokemon game where like you can legit run through the game with one Pokemon. So I definitely need a new Pokemon on my squad. Aerial is going to pop out here. And is that it? That all we had to do? Light work. Light work. I probably could have caught that. But big levels, my Cyndaquil doesn't get no XP. The one Pokemon I wanted to get XP does get nothing on a big XP thing. It was like 322, which is a lot so far. I'm loving it. But there we go. Take you out. Can you help my Cyndaquil? Thank you very much, lady. Weird. What is that? What in the world is that? Oh, it's Weird Ear. Stantler's Hisuian Stantler. Or Weird Ear, his name is. The Great Weird Ear. You get to ride on these things. I would love to be able to ride on them. Stantler's out and about. Yo, look at him. He's coming up to us. What's good, dog? Seems like a goddess here. My dog, my dog. Dot, 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 dot. He looks upon you with kindness, jeans. Oh, let me hop on this thing's back. Let me get on it. Let me saddle up. I say the great weirdo has taken a liking to you. That is fortunate. He is an esteemed Pokemon that can dash across the expanses of Hisuian while bearing a human on its back. A human he deems is worthy, at least. I'm going to be the worthy human. Let's do it. And is this Akira? Yeah. Or Akara? What's up? Change carried out a request. Uh, what do you want from me? What do you want from me, Akari? But there we go. Complete another main mission. We are thriving. We are thriving. We're going to be recording for probably another, another decent couple minutes. Let's, keep, let's just keep pushing through. So we complete that main mission. We get done with that. I have a Starly side quest, which I'm done with. I just have to cash in there. And I have to remember to craft more Pokeballs. Potions, revives, all that good stuff. Because, you know, Cyndaquil has been taking a beat. And what is going on here? Oh, we set up camp. Awesome. So we set up camp here. I believe you can fast travel through camps. And what? It, yo, what is that behind that flag? See that little thing moving up there? Is that tree wiggling up top there? I don't know. I thought it was a Pokemon at first. But we set up another camp, which is awesome. I can craft here. I can heal up here. And we get rolling out. Nice work today. What we all say? We head to the Wallflower. All right, we're going to go eat. But here we go. We uh, catch some new Pokemon for the squad. And we get some more Poke Dollars, which is awesome. I would love to upgrade my bag. I would love to upgrade my bag. So Starly's done. Awesome. We complete that in the Pokedex. And we level up all these other guys. Juju's already level 7, which is awesome. Species newly registered or updated for. Awesome. And we get some more points to upgrade our star rank. 
the star rank's gonna take longer and longer to upgrade, especially when uh you start catching more and more Pokemon, because you get more XP due to catching new Pokemon, and then eventually you're just gonna have no more new Pokemon to catch. But we head back to our favorite place, which is the Wallflower. And if I had to guess from Jubilife City, you can probably uh fast travel to whatever campsite you want to go to. So hopefully that's the case, and hopefully that's good. But at least they took me back to Jubilife. Because in this case, I have to actually uh hand in that side quest. And then I can pick up more. Then I can pick up more. But I did not find that mushroom that that guy wanted for this first side quest when we entered the Obsidian uh, Fieldlands. That's cool. We caught a few new Pokemon, defeated our first noble Pokemon, and we got to see Weird Deer. Weird Deer is sick. I dig it. I'm sleeping in my little my little place. Oh, she's she dude, she just banged on my door, yo. Who does this chick th think she is? Who does she think she is? I'm coming for you. Actually, should I craft? I kinda wanna craft. Can I craft here? No, I can only investigate and cook. And what is this? This is my oh, I can investigate this stuff. And this is all my stuff in my satchel. And what is this? Grit does we need that mushroom. I have to create some more Pokeballs, which I would love to do. We have some nice stone. We have a few of those. And I should actually create revives. I should create revives. Let's head over here. Akari's out here. She said, yo, hurry up, Jeans. She has something important to show us. It's better be good. Waking me up at the butt of dawn over here. The butt crack of dawn, yo. <laughs> but, okay. More characters. Cool. So, I love how this story is. I like how it's pretty immersed, too. There you go again, insisting uh, you're false. Okay, so we got two people arguing. Ottoman and Rita. I love the names. Some really sick names. Like I said in, in part one, this this uh, Hisuian like, region fits perfectly for this game. Everything about the architectural design, the character design, like everything is fitting perfectly in this storyline. I'm loving it so much. You feel the tension between those two. You haven't met them yet, ha have you? The woman with the uh, reference... Where the space is the leader of the leader of the Pearl Clan, and the man is the leader of the Diamond Clan. So there's the Pearl Clan and Diamond Clan. Do I get to choose which clan I want to join? That'd be pretty cool. That'd be pretty cool. But uh, what do I have to do from here? I guess I have to go into there. But I want to go talk to uh, who had the side quest for me. Is it you? No. It was you. You want the Star Lead on? I have the Star Lead on for you. Here you go, sweetheart. Did you complete Star Lead? Of course I did. There you go. Starly, all done just for you. That's what I want to do. But yeah, in order to complete the... Did I do it? Yeah, I just showed you Starly. Oh, here you go. You'll have that... No, is that my best Starly? Starly? Don't take my Starly. Want to touch it? Yeah, you can touch it. Just don't keep it. Starly, peck on her. <laughs> oh, yo, Starly pecked on her, bro. <laughs> I was like, what happened? Starly was attacking, but adorable Starly. Done. We get 10 po That's lovely. Saves me some crafting materials, which is awesome. So I finish up on this crafting materials, I can actually check my missions and stuff I gotta do. So, gotta go talk to the, him, and then the mushroom cake, where I just have to find a springy mushroom. Which I haven't been able to find yet, but yeah, we'll find it in a new area. We will definitely find it in a new, new area. Let's keep crushing these missions. Keep crushing up on these missions. Head over to this guy. Can you upgrade my bag yet, dude? Yes, I cannot. Well, let's go over here and see this thing. Oh, is it, wait, is that what I have to do, or... Is that a side mission? Where's my main mission at? My main mission's on the third floor. Okay, so there's side quests up there. We have to head to the third floor. Awesome. So the, the side quests have little, little little squares to it, and then the big one has like that big square with a dot in it. That's how you know which one's your main mission and the other ones are side missions. Let's roll up the stairs and hello. Do I get to pick a clan? Is this how it works? That'd be pretty tough. That would be pretty tough. What do you tend to do about the cleaver? Oh, cleaver! Cleaver is one of the two brand new Pokemon in this game. You got Cleaver and Anandras. I would love a Cleaver, dude. I'm going to go see him. Yo, he's sick. Cleaver is so sick. All right. Let's roll up. Are we going to do that? Are we going to go visit him? That would be amazing. Visit a lovely little Cleaver and catch it. I don't know if you can catch a Cleaver or you have to evolve it. Scyther. But here I am. Ready to do work. I hear from my you earned a Weird Ears favor. Yes, we did. I want to ride it. I want to ride it. So we got the leader of the Pearl Clan and the leader of the Diamond Clan chilling here. I don't know if we get to pick one. That'd be pretty cool. That would be pretty cool. And I wouldn't know which one to pick. It'd be a tough decision for me. Let's see. Let's see. Let me let me go back into the area. Defeat our first noble Pokemon. We got Weirdear, which is awesome. 
I would love to do one more little thing in today's video, which would be awesome. So let's see. In order for you to study Cleaver, you must help us find the truth of the situation. Oh, yes, sir. I guess we're heading towards Cleaver, which is awesome. Remember that you are a stranger who appeared one day out of the very sky above us. People are naturally suspicious of your presence here. If you wish to be fully accepted and trusted, you must work hard. Work yourself to the very bone. The frenzy to the Lord of the Woods. Okay. So is this where I have to go? The Lord of the Woods Cleaver is descending from the Pokemon that was blessed with the almighty Sinnoh-owned power. No other Pokemon of you yet encounter can compare to his strength. Be warned. We get after Cleaver, baby. Love it. I wonder if I can catch Cleaver or do I have to defeat it? I wonder. Join me downstairs, Jeans. We'll cover the details for the new mission. I got gotcha. you. Roger that. Let's head downstairs. So we got a huge new mission upon our hands, which is to catch Cleaver. Or defeat Cleaver, other one. One or the other. One or the other. And I would, I'm not going to lie. I would love to have Cleaver on my team. He's definitely a Pokemon that I want. It's like, how can you play this game and not have Cleaver on your team? It is the one new Pokemon that is not new. That is not a legendary. You got to put it on your team. If you're playing this game and you don't have Cleaver on your team, get out of my face. Or at least some Hisuian forms. My team, I cannot wait to showcase it to you guys. I cannot wait to rock out with it. I cannot wait to get it. But we're talking to this guy. Hopefully, we can actually get started with the mission. And make our way towards Cleaver. And then in the next episode, we'll catch him. That'd be beautiful. That would just be dandy. But I love just collecting stuff. I love just being out in the open. And just doing a bunch of stuff. Why does everybody want to speak to me? Like, I just spoken to like 10 different people tell me a bunch of different things to do let me go out there and let me get after it so let's see We're talking about the cleaver situation baby bobby booby bobby he's gonna elaborate those pro clan types have a lot of respect for cleaver you heard of this lord of the woods i'm sure they'd rather get this under control too but it's hard for them to come out and risk an answers of team galaxy okay makes sense but again let me go let me move forward So Maya's telling us we can find Cleaver at the Grand Tree area, I think she said. So she's telling us exactly where to go. So I guess we can start heading there. That could be that could be where we finish off in today's video. We've been recording for about 45 minutes, which is lovely. Find your way to the Grand Tree area and speak to Leon to get information. Oh, okay. Never mind. I don't think we are getting Cleaver here, but can I talk to you? And Can you upgrade my bag yet? Let's see. No, dude. Why can't I upgrade my bag yet? Maybe two stars is the way. But our bag, we don't really need bag space right now. Yo, why is everybody talking to me? Oh, wait, can I upgrade my bag for you now? He's going to let me upgrade my bag. I know it. Did he just say? Yeah, see, here's some more space. Yeah, I'd like to upgrade my bag. Teach me. Oh, yes, $100? There you go. Take it. Upgrade my bag space. You made space to keep one more kind. Okay, awesome. Upgrade again. Teach me again. How much is the next one? 200 Yo, run it up. Run it up. That's cheap right now. Price is just going to keep going up and up. It's kind of like the Korok Seeds in Breath of the Wild. Where, uh... Okay, so it goes up by 100 each time so far. But the Korok Seeds kept going up and up in price. This one's only going up by 100, so I don't mind keep spending it. I'll buy, I'll buy 5 if it goes up to 500. Yeah, 400. I'll buy 5. I will buy 5, which will be lovely. So we'll get an upgrade on the bag, bag space, and then we're heading out. And then we're making our way. Watch me again, baby. Watch me again. Bag space upgraded. Dope. So a lot of talking in this episode, not really a little bit, but we ended up going and uh, defeating a noble Pokemon, which is awesome, which is Cricketot. Just lovely Cricketot. And I believe there's like a bunch of different noble Pokemon that you have to run after in KO, or Alpha Pokemon, as you should say. Or as I should say. But I can go here now, and I can grab another side quest if I want to, which I might do. Actually, I'm going to grab a side quest of that uh, chick out here. All right, let's keep rolling through, and then we get to make our way here. Do 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 do. And let's see if I can go to different base camps. That's, that's a good question for me. So, how are things, my good friend? Volo wants to talk to us now? Bro, everybody wants to talk to Jeans right now. I swear, they were they just, they just put this in the game for everybody to talk to you. What's he give me? Oh, three super potions. I gotta remember to craft. I do have to remember to craft before I actually make my way towards the cleaver. So we're gonna head out here. Hang outside the village. Stay safe out there, kids. So, I can guess I can head. I guess I have to head to here. I guess I have to head to here. Can't fast travel to our other uh, spot. Okay, not bad. Not bad. So, Obsidian Fields. Let's go to our crafting table here. And I can craft Heavy Balls. A ball that is uh, too heavy to fly far, but it's highly effective if you manage to hit it. Okay. So, it's very, very good. And it costs one. I'm actually going to make like three. And I'll make a bunch of other of these. Like eight of them. 
get some potions up in here. Five of those and get some revives here too. Dope. Dope, dope, dope. Okay, cool. So now we can just make our way and yo, look how many steps we have to take. God dang, we have to get moving. And wait, I wanted your side quest. Wasn't there a side quest here? There was indeed. We have to get moving. Come here, what, what, what you need? What you need, lady? Boom, that marvelous rich tone. How is it produced? I must know. It's here. Hello, didn't see you there. Blah, blah, blah. You're from Syracuse. You need a cricket tile? I have one. I have one. Just take mine. Wait, what's it? Oh, I got to complete the cricket tile. Okay. Makes sense. So we got to he head that way anyway. So we'll make our way there. Uh, let me actually see what I have to do for cricket tile. Open up my Pokedex, and where's my Cricket Tot at? Cricket Tot, call it without being spotted. I have to catch one, defeat another one, catch a few more. Okay, cool. Let's roll. Let's get it, baby. So I have my Cyndaquil here. Looking for more materials. Badoof, I'm not worried about you. Get on my face. <laughs> God dang Badoof. God dang Badoof. And did these berries respawn? They did. I grab this. I can throw this. And just keep moving forward. But that's what I love. Like I said, I can collect stuff and move at the same time, which is awesome. There's some Starlies. I'll throw my Cyndaquil over here. Go ahead, Cyndaquil. Do your thing. Do your thing. Give me all my materials. And we'll keep rolling out here. <coughs> so I have to head across this bridge. But for the meantime... <gasps> Yo, that's a shiny Bidoof. Yo, I found a shiny Bidoof. That's a shiny Bidoof. It did the shiny animation. It's, dude, please tell me that's a shiny Bidoof. That's a shiny Bidoof. Hold up. How do I check? I have to make my way to the base camp. I just called a shiny Bidoof. Episode 2. No way. Can I check my Pokedex to see if I found a shiny one? Where's Bidoof at? Bidoof. I know he was shiny. He did the shiny animation. He did. Yo, we have to find a camp. We have to find a camp. There's no way. I'm going to make my way up to this camp up there. And then probably finish the episode up there. But I have to see if we call a shiny Bidoof. No way. We just caught a shiny Bidoof. I actually have to catch another one of you. Catch you. Where are you going, Cricket Hot? Dang, dude, I just wasted a bunch of Pokeballs, but dude, I can't believe we caught it. I can't believe it. I cannot believe it. That is crazy. Right? That was shiny. I have to make sure. Starly's over here. Switch to you. Give me you. I can head that way, too, which is pretty cool. Oh, there's a few Cricket Thoughts over here. I really want to get. I really want to get. Get you. I'll defeat another one, too. I'll actually throw my Cynical over here first. Launch you. Switch my Pokeball. Let me switch to Cynical over here. I'll fight you. I hit a back straight there because he turned his back. And I had to defeat a few Cricket Hots. So we're just trying to level up the research ones. And that one got away. Son of a biscuit. We'll go into an Ember. And then we'll just get moving here. I believe I can just like run away basically. While the battle's going. You defeated Cricket Hot. Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Yo. I'm loving it. I'm loving it, dude. I have to make sure that's a shiny Bidoof. That is hilarious if we caught one already. But it is still like a 1 in 4,000 chance, they say. But you just have a higher chance because there's so many Pokemon that spawn out. That's pretty cool. It's really, really cool. I'll snipe you. I'm in the grass. He don't see me. Let's catch him. Let's try to catch this Cricket Dot. Need more Cricket Dots. Can I snipe you from here? I can indeed this do that and we'll roll out it really popped out i oh, know we caught it awesome 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 let's roll more materials the better so we're gonna tuck this this way and make our way up to that camp you getting that cynical i need you to get that stuff yeah don't fight the starling awesome so we get that material there's some geo dudes over here geo dudes are a dang pain man i'm just gonna run past them no need to battle him, but I wish there was a way to, like, fast travel up to this camp. Would have made my life ten times easier. Definitely would have made my life ten times easier. We got this black, uh, tumble stone right here. Definitely needed to make some heavy balls. We'll take that out. We got some more Starlies here. And we got some more tumble stones. But, yo. Shiny Badoof? Please. Please show me that's a shiny Badoof. I believe it is. 
I believe it is. I did see like gameplay on shiny Pokemon, but yo, you can hear the sound of shiny from a mile away. You dude's trying to get after me. I know there's some uh, gears up there. I'm gonna head to this base. I'm gonna head to this base, and we gotta go talk to my guy right here. I think he says it. What's your Pokemon items? Uh, let's see. Uh, I want to see my Pokemon. Where's Bidoof at? That's shiny. That is shiny Bidoof. Oh my God, we got a shiny Bidoof. He's shiny. There's see the little shiny marker. <laughs> we got a shiny Pokemon already in this game. That's absolutely amazing. Can we release Pokemon? Oh, we can. I might have to do that. I might have to do that later, or that might be an off-screen thing, or off, yeah, off-screen thing. Kind of just get after it. But guys, that is going to be it for today's video. If you did enjoy the content, don't forget to smash that like button for me. And if you're new here, click that big red subscribe button so you know my videos go live. As in the next episode, we're going to be com completing the Cleaver, uh, the Cleaver, I can't even speak, the Cleaver mission and moving on with the main story and probably catching some new Pokemon for our team. But thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you all in the next one. Peace out, everybody.